Hey YouTube, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So y'all see what's going on by the title. I'm so excited. Today is August the 28th, so I've already got my tickets. Let me tell y'all how I got my tickets to the concert, right? So this man literally posted on his Twitter and his Instagram. I understand my fans, some of my fans is tight on money and y'all have, you know, XYZ going on. This dude literally bought, he bought tickets. He bought extra tickets to make up for the tickets that already sold out what other artist does that i'm just saying what other artist does that that was so sweet of him i was just like oh my gosh because i'm gonna see my man up front this time he gonna see me and i'm gonna see him i just got my hair done i'm gonna see how well my subscribers know me what's my favorite fast food restaurant so yeah y'all i'm so excited <laughs> Yeah, good morning. So this is the morning after the concert. I'm tired. I'm sleepy. I had so much fun last night. Long story short, I did not. I was not able to get the meet and greet tickets. I literally decided at the very last minute. When I say very last minute very last minute that I was going. I had so much going on yesterday. And I drove out to Charlotte from, well, from Apex. I drove out to Charlotte directly from Apex. And y'all, we were standing in line for like 40 minutes. It was people that got there early. I literally pulled up at like 6.47. The line was still sitting outside. The concert was supposed to start at 7 o'clock. So I think we went in, I don't know, I want to say like, I want to say like 7.40, somewhere around that we went in. And as far as, okay, as far as concerts, I understand, you know, these are upcoming artists. They have to get their name out there. But I personally feel like they should perform at like a club or Somewhere else. I mean, if I had, if I was going into the industry and I had an opportunity to do a performance with one of my favorite artists, I definitely would too. But I feel like they have too many artists perform from the jump before we see the actual artist. Because Blue, he didn't come out until around like 9.30. It was around, I want to say like 10.15-ish that he left. It's so much fun. And y'all, I really think Blue, I think he looked at me. I got a front seat view. Well, a front, it was general admission. I got a view at the very, very front. He was able to see me. Hey, Boo, if you watching this. And also, he announced at the show last night that he canceled the rest of his tour. So I'm so glad that I went ahead and went because I went on his Instagram before I went in and people talking about, oh, he canceled the show in Richmond. And I'm like, why would he do that? And then I came to find out later on, he canceled the rest of his tour. So I'm like, wow, I'm so glad that I went. But I was saying to if any of y'all have been into a concert in North Carolina, do y'all ever realize the difference in like other states? Um, states like Georgia, Texas, California, Florida, um, just different areas. Do y'all ever realize like the concerts, they are completely different. They are way more hype. Um, I personally feel like in other states, not just blue, but like other artists too, they perform better songs unless it's like um, more of like a mainstream artist. But I mean, at this point, I feel like blue, he's mainstream, you know what I'm saying? But um, he's becoming more mainstream. But I really like, I just feel like if I was to go to another state and attend a concert, I would have like so much more fun. It's not that I didn't have fun. I had a blast. I had a blast. I had a blast. But I want 
better concert experiences. Before y'all attack me, I'm not ungrateful. I am super grateful because y'all know how long I've been waiting to see Blue. At this point, y'all know what happened with my first with my first concert, well, not my first concert, but my first experience seeing Blue, I didn't really get to see him. The time I was like really able to see him, I had a front view and everything. I had fun, but I know some of y'all can relate to what I'm saying. Once and I'm gonna say it again, I had so much fun. I had a great time, but I'm really excited to see my new experiences when I start back traveling in new states, not even just with concerts, but with like a lot of other stuff, but especially concerts. Y'all cannot sit here and tell me that y'all don't catch this same vibe. Y'all cannot sit here and tell me that. Like, look in other states. Look how much more broad things are. Y'all see what I'm saying? If you was born and raised in North Carolina, then you already know. Enough said at this point, but y'all thank y'all so much for tuning back in. Make sure you like it, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe, and I'm gonna see y'all in the next video. Bye.